Welcome to Cowbellpedia. I would like to congratulate you for making it to be one of the top 54 in your category. For you to have made it this far, that means you are best in your state and you are best in Nigeria. So I think for that you deserve a round of applause. Okay, so a cowbell for us um, over the years, the thrust of this initiative has remained the same. We believe in um, the overall development of Nigerian child, and that is why we ensure that there is quality and affordable nutrition for every Nigerian child, and same as education. This year, Calvin is celebrating 20 years relationship with mathematics. How awesome is that? 24 years. For the 20 years anniversary, we have quite a number of things lined up to ensure that it is different from the previous editions of Calvipedia you know. Does anybody know the prize money for this year's winner? Oh, quite a number of people. Two million. Okay, that's for the first. Second? One point five million. The third? One million. Class for you. The prize money has doubled, same at the state level, and also for the teachers. And another thing we had this year, does anybody know about Calvipedia Compendium? Did your school benefit from it? Yes, Calvipedia Compendium is a compilation of all past questions on the show that captures both senior and junior secondary classes. And number two is Calvipedia Academy. It's an initiative put together to mark the 20th anniversary, basically to teach and bring to four new ways which you as students can learn mathematics and even your teachers can learn new techniques to teach you mathematics and we wish you all the very best in the competition. This is still the 2018 edition and we're itching closer to the grand finale of what has been a very keenly competed tournament right from stage one to this point where we are knocking on the door of the finals. Welcome to another exciting season of Cowbellpedia your mathematics TV quiz show for secondary schools in Nigeria. The smile on my face is because this is a special year. Why is it a special year? It's 20 years of Cowbell's partnership with mathematics and trust us to celebrate it in grand style. The 2018 edition is particularly special because it's a milestone celebration of Cowbell, our milk support of the subject called mathematics. 20 years ago, Cowbell R. Milk started a beautiful relationship with mathematics for secondary schools in Nigeria. Today, this relationship has blossomed into a force to be reckoned with in Nigeria's education sector. Over the years, Primacidor, makers of Cowbell R. Milk, the sponsor of this laudable project, has continued to improve and upgrade the project. Today, what began as a regional event with a few schools is now a national TV quiz competition for secondary schools. The Carbell Choco formula has been stolen. Get it back at all costs. Great tasting Carbell Choco gives you the get up and go to be at the top of your game. Now with Vitarich Plus Iron. 
great tasting cowbell choco, a creamy chocolatey drink that helps give energy to get up and go. Now 30 naira only for the 20 gram sachet. Cowbellpedia has become technology driven and interactive with over 41,735 students from over 4,857 schools writing the stage one exams in 2018. Currently, Cowbellpedia has about the largest electronic database of students in Nigeria and the competition has metamorphosed from only the written examination into the various other platforms where students meet with mathematics. The TV quiz show showing on cable and free-to-air networks where students get inspired by watching their contemporaries solve math questions in seconds. Cowbellpedia on radio, the daily five minutes maths class on radio where a maths question is taken, explained and solved for the benefit of the listener. Cowbellpedia on radio airs Monday to Friday on radio stations across the nation. Cowbellpedia app on Android and iOS devices which can be downloaded from Google Play Store and the Apple Store. Thus students can have access to thousands of mathematics questions on the go. The Cowbellpedia Compendium which is a compilation of past questions from the TV quiz show. This printed compilation of questions and how to solve them is distributed to the first 1,000 schools that register for the competition annually. The Cowbellpedia Academy, where experts in mathematics are brought in from top-notch foreign institutions to teach students how to apply their knowledge of mathematics to everything they do, and their teachers are taught how to teach mathematics better in a fun way which will make children happy to learn the subject. Cowbell R Milk has continued to communicate mathematics through these different platforms so that every secondary school student conveniently has some sort of interaction with mathematics, thereby demystifying the subject and banishing the fear of mathematics from the minds of these students. To further encourage the participants in the competition and to commemorate the 20th anniversary of Cowbell's support for mathematics, the prize monies have been reviewed upwards to over 30 million naira per year. This season, season four, has basically been upgraded. There, there are more rewards up for grabs. Now, you want to sit back and take a pen and paper and note this. First things first, over 30 million naira will be shared between the winners and the teachers of the competition, not forgetting the bragging rights as the best mathematics students in Nigeria, from the qualifying examination stage all the way to the finals. Second up, everything is double. What am I talking about? Well, the cash prize this season is two million naira from one million naira last season. So the winners in the junior and senior category are gonna walk away with a two million naira cash prize, the title of the best mathematicians in Nigeria. And of course, we have the first and second runner ups walking away with 1.5 million and 1 million naira respectively. The ever hardworking teachers are not left out of this review. The teacher of the champion will also win 500,000 naira up from 400,000 naira. With Cowbellpedia, teachers are reassured that it pays to groom mathematicians. Aside from the student, teachers and competition proper, Cowbell R Milk also supports the Cowbellpedia Milk of Kindness, a special docu-feature created as part of the activities to commemorate the 20th anniversary of the relationship between Cowbell and Mats. The aim of the Milk of Kindness documentary is to explore human angle stories that will celebrate and drive the reinforcements of the ethos of Cowbell in our communities vis-a-vis -vis this intervention. Would you like to win 2 million Naira, educational holiday trip abroad and the bragging rights as the best mathematics student? Well, your journey starts now. Get your school to register you for free today at www.cowbellpedia.ng for the 2019 Cowbellpedia qualifying examinations which begins on Monday 1st of October 2018 and closes on Sunday 3rd of February 2019 ahead of the written examinations on Saturday February the 9th 2019. The first 1,000 schools to complete their registration win the Cowbellpedia Compendium. Cowbellpedia is endorsed by Neko and brought to you by Cowbell, our milk, enriched with Vita Rich and Vitamin B9.
love ay, your ay, meal. Ay, ay, Deliciously creamy with all the goodness of Vitarich. That's how we've made the new Cowbell Evaporated Milk. Cowbell Evaporated Milk. Evaporated just for you. The 2018 Cowbell Pedia journey started with 41,735,000 students who registered for the national qualifying examinations, out of which 108 made up of 54 each in the junior and senior category made it to the quiz show. The keenly contested competition saw the numbers dropping at each stage as the best of the best knocked each other out. It has been an exciting journey on the 2018 edition with records being smashed, not just broken. Sit back, relax, and let me take you through the road to the finals of the 2018 Cowbellpedia Mathematics TV Quiz Show. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich, plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, deliciously creamy. Would you like to win 2 million Naira, educational holiday trip abroad and the bragging rights as the best mathematics student? Well, your journey starts now. Get your school to register you for free today at www.cowbellpedia.ng for the 2019 Cowbellpedia qualifying examinations which begins on Monday 1st of October 2018 and closes on Sunday 3rd of February 2019 ahead of the written examinations on Saturday February the 9th 2019. The first 1,000 schools to complete their registration win the Cowbellpedia compendium. Cowbellpedia is endorsed by Neko and brought to you by Cowbell, our milk, enriched with Vita-Rich and vitamin B9. Quite an interesting journey it has been so far on this special 20th anniversary edition of Cowbellpedia. But I can assure you that the best is yet to come because we still have these 12 geniuses who will file out at the finals to give us an epic climax to the 2018 edition of Cowbellpedia. Let's meet them. I am one of the six finalists in the junior category of the Cowbellpedia 2018 TV quiz show. Welcome to my home. Chidoze, I wish you all the best. You're on 60 points. Your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. I discovered that Okezie Chidoze, my son, is interested in mathematics right from childhood. Then he almost won all the best in mathematics uh, award at the end of every year. I always loved mathematics, but when I got to secondary school, I found out that if I'm good at maths, there will be a lot of awards to win. So that helped build my love for mathematics and it got higher and higher. And uh, in the course of time, that development continued to be constant because of the assistance of his eldest brother, Kelechi Chukwemeka Cheduzie. I've helped him develop himself by helping him in various ways, teaching him the basic fundamentals of, of mathematics, right from his nursery school to his primary school, now in his secondary school. The love he has in mathematics can even make him, when, he, when he's solving mathematics, even if you call him to come and eat, he will not even mind forgetting about the food. We call him math magician. He's very good in mathematics. He does it with all simplicity. No, it is not complex for him. Chiodoze Zochuku is a student who is passionate about um, academics generally. Uh, he always works towards success. He is focused. Um, he works with his teachers with the view to achieving his goal. The thing that makes Okeze special in mathematics is that he is disciplined. He can involve himself in mathematics, do, working on mathematics for a very long time. He set his goal for himself and you can always see him studying, working independently and you can as well see him meet teachers to seek for assistance when need be. And um, the result of his effort can always be 
listen. He has all it takes by the grace of God to win the competition. My advice to him is that he should try and work on his speed, feel relaxed, and has confidence also in God that God will help him. We are going to comfort him psychologically to build that confidence in him to just go. In addition to our encouragement, our less mother blessing Chibarakebe Odumoko. Gives him encouragement by giving him prizes whenever he gets prize in mathematics. I'm not overconfident, but I'm confident that I'll win. I don't think my school has won this before, and if I do, I'll be the first in my school to do it. Congratulations to you, Chi Jose. You scored 120 points, but you won't be able to eat everything just now. You need to get to the finals. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. I want to appreciate the effort of the teachers and several other people who had made contribution to his development. Some of them don't even know he has gotten to, to this stage, but wherever they are, I pray that God will bless them and bless you too, including the entire Kawepedia. Two million Naira is up for grabs. Do you have any idea yet what you're going to do with all that money? There are a lot of options. Give me one option. You depends. I have to depends. take it home first. Ah. Let the money he will win come. If the money comes, there are a lot of uh, mouths waiting to swallow it. <laughs>
she bring the price to this school. Even if she doesn't, maybe she'll become like a math genius later or something. I definitely think she will become first. Yes. I would dedicate my victory to God at the end of the competition. I began to fall in love with Mars while, while I was a kid and I was fortunate to have my mother as my class teacher. I discovered he loved mathematics from KG2. When I give him work, he always do it on time and ask me to give him the money as until when we get home. Gabriel Kogun is a very diligent student, very hardworking. Whenever he's given an assignment, he, he does it excellently well. He's a boy that is very focused. He's a genius. He's a gifted boy, very mathematical, and he has passion for education, especially mathematics. A lot of things are special about him. He's a gentle boy, easygoing. He's very hardworking and caring. He's also loving. When the quiz master told me that I qualified for the finals, the first thing that came to my mind was that my friends my family and my school will be happy about it. I was so happy. I jumped up, I shouted. I was so elevated as the principal of the school because we deserved it. It's a thing that we expected because we really worked for it. And I know that God that started it will surely perfect it to his own glory. God, my parents, my teachers, and my friends have been so supportive throughout this journey so far. Uh, myself, I like the subject, I teach the subject. So I encourage him, helping him with his assignment and uh, also making available some of those things that he needs and he has been cooperative. We try to simulate as much as possible exactly what he was going to see when he, get, when he gets to the studio. He asked him questions, we timed him in the same 60 seconds that we knew that it was so to prepare his mind and to build his confidence. Then we have our video seconds of film starts now. Three. So, correct. Six seconds plus three exit. Correct. Simplify seven. seven. Correct. Simplify my answer. Seven key. Incorrect. The school have put so much into the preparation for competition as well as the teachers to ensure that our students, when they go for competition, don't just participate but uh, become winners of these competitions. I'm not under any pressure, but I'll take that it comes. Two things very important. You believe in God, be confident in yourself. I believe in that it's going to win. He has what it takes to win the competition because he's hard working and he has confidence in God. We want our school working to win 2018 Kabepidia Junior category. That will be a very good part on the back for not just me, but all these teachers involved in training Gabriel. And I think it will be a means for God to announce our school. For me personally, I think Kabepidia is doing something great in this country. But if we have organizations that can do like Kabepidia, and then organize quality competitions that help them, especially in the sciences. I think it will be very good. I think uh, kudos should be given to Kabe for this wonderful achievement. Plendo is a nice guy. He's a nice boy from cradle to now. He has been a wonderful child in the family, very humble, very obedient. He doesn't really talk that much. Um, he's relatively calm. He has a um, good relationship with his friends. I remember once uh, one of the students in his class came here and was telling me about uh, her own performance in mathematics. And then she said that people like Splendor don't have problems in mathematics. Because in our school year, we rotate teachers every session. So when they got to JS2, I was privileged to be his teacher then. That was when I started to know him more. I like to play football, play games, and so much. Give him one or two things to add together. He comes up with wonderful results. The rate at which he grows is very alarming. In terms of speed, in terms of accuracy, it's going every day. While on the show, my most memorable moments were when, was when I was told that I qualified to the finals. 
Joining Favor in the finals of the season four of Calvopedia is, with 110 points, Splendor. Well done. When I heard that he made it to the finals, I was so excited. Based on his strength in math, I never had any doubt that he's going to go to the final stage. I was happy that he had attained this height in the competition. Looking forward to his final success in the final. It will be a great assurance really to us that we are doing the right thing. Some people that have been supportive to me throughout this journey on Carbopedia, my, my parents, my siblings, my math teacher, and my school in general. You can never lose all the splendor. It's not possible. You will be the one to be bereft of questions to ask him. Because the more you try to think that you have given him the ones you believe is okay for his level, you will discover that you have not done anything at all. That you need to give him more. Splendor undertakes private studies on his own personal research. And I think that is what has been helping him to flourish in, in this maths competition. At the point, I didn't think I was going to make it to the final because of the tiebreak I had to go through in my semi-final. You did very well, okay? No matter what I say, you did very well. I guess I'll see you in round two as well. Congratulations. In the quiz show, I would like to improve my speed in the 60 seconds of fame. The cowboy competition is a very wonderful one. I think um, I support the idea. It kind of motivates children to work harder in mathematics. Amongst the other finalists, there is none I think. Apart from solving maths, I also do other things like riding bicycle, playing my guitar, and having fun generally. Ake Foluwa is a bright boy. He's a humble person, uh, someone that is fun to be with, of course. <laughs> he has been different. A lot of things I've seen about him. He's a very studious student, very intelligent, very young, but very, very agile in everything. He does. He's the kind of boy that makes the house lively, even his dog. He just makes some jokes and we just laugh about it. He's a funny boy. It's fun to be with. I think he has a healthy relationship with his colleagues. He carries them along and they also, you know, come around him from time to time when one observes them. Some people are supporting my journey to the career, like my friends, my family, the school. For Kaubepedia, it's a teamwork in this school. Many teachers came together in order to train him, even from his grade seven to grade nine. We have this um, LD rivalry system that we've created in the school, whereby the students work with each other collaboratively and competitively, and that has helped him because in here he has worked with the best of the best. They've challenged him, he has challenged them. And so whenever he goes out for any competition or the other, he's still able to come up well when he comes up with the best from all over the country. In his pursuit uh, of learning mathematics, I have um, tried as much as possible in various ways to encourage him. Attending some of the competitions he has been to, then of course, um, Encourage him in terms of uh, creating a study habit for him. At times when he has issues, he comes to meet me in his mass and I believe to offer help. My most memorable moment in Kaupia TV question was the time I found that I broke the record and I got 18 questions in one minute. Express your Express point. Express something, tell us one minus three. Correct. If 3% of a number is 24, find the number. 800. Correct. Correct, 23. 233.1. Correct. The final record was 17 questions in one minute, and when he got 18 questions in one minute, I was very glad. I thank God for that, that he created a record, and I think that is something that I at least can go with. I'm not under any pressure of any form, and I'll just take it as it comes. My advice to him is he should be calm, he should put in his best, and he should put all his trust in God. We're going to increase the speed to stay focused and know that you shouldn't be nervous. Lock out distractions and be able to face what's meant to come show for. And we will go to the finals, part of the last six, as all it takes to win it. And I think he can. Winning the competition, for me, we boost my mother in order to train the people that are 
come in after him. And that will also boost the mother of students that are looking on to him. His achievements in mathematics has also made me to also want to work harder and be like him. The product of Akabepedia in this school, they've done a lot. Some of them are studying in the United States. Uh, for me, it's a fulfillment. Having participated, they also take that winning streak into other subjects. And um, I'm very happy that our ideas, our thoughts, and everything are coming to pass. If I eventually win this commission, I'll dedicate my victory to God for bringing me this far. Favor Okarige is a student of Grayson International School. She won the best student for the year 2017-2018. She is calm and very coordinated in whatever she is out to do. Right from her nursery primary, she was really doing well. In fact, from just one, she has been getting 100, 100. It was then dawn on me that this girl is good in mathematics. I like drawing, singing, playing games. She's an all-rounder. She's very good at other subjects. And aside mathematics, she, she spends more time in artwork, drawing and designing and stuff like that. I want to be a medical doctor in future because I want to help other people. I want to save lives. She's got so much dream. She wants to achieve so much at her young age. So that is what set her apart from many other students in this group. And in whichever way I can support her, maybe by textbook, whichever textbook she requests for, we go out to get it. My most memorable moment in the quiz show was when the quiz master told me that I had qualified for the final. Five points separates the third position from the second from the first. I only need two contestants in the final. I can tell you that there will be a male and a female in the final. Favor, congratulations to you. The first thing that came to my mind was telling my parents and my siblings that qualified for the finals. But I was dancing to the glory of God. I was happy as any other person would be for the sibling. Our the preparation has been in different phases. We go through practice with the teacher. We go through the, the different seasons of the program. And also, we also prepare our own slides for the children to go through during the training period. And it's highly rigorous. I don't have any threats in finals, and I'm not scared at all, because I know if I add more work and more reading, I'll be able to do even better than others will do. My advice to, for her is that she should not relent. She should do better than she has been doing. To keep up the hard work, read hard. It is not over until it is over. I believe she's going to get uh, what we are all anticipating. We involve ourselves in a lot of competitions, so winning has a lot to contribute to the school, um, promote the image of the school, and. Um, it's an encouragement to upcoming students in the school. If I win the competition, I'm going to dedicate my success to God, my parents, my siblings, my friends in school, all those that have encouraged me, and my teacher that taught me. Carvel competition is, uh, uh, is wonderful. It's the most prestigious competition in Nigeria. At least it's bringing up the potential in, in, in our children, particularly in the uh, hardcore mathematics. Deliciously creamy with all the goodness of Vitarich. That's how we've made the new Cowbell Evaporated Milk. Cowbell Evaporated Milk. Evaporated just for you. Instantly dissolving Cowbell Milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. 
Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich, plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, deliciously creamy. Would you like to win 2 million Naira, educational holiday trip abroad, and the bragging rights as the best mathematics student? Well, your journey starts now. Get your school to register you for free today at www.cowbellpedia.ng for the 2019 Cowbellpedia qualifying examinations, which begins on Monday, 1st of October 2018 and closes on Sunday, 3rd of February 2019, ahead of the written examinations on Saturday, February the 9th, 2019. The first 1,000 schools to complete their registration win the Cowbellpedia compendium. Cowbellpedia is endorsed by Neko and brought to you by Cowbell, our milk, enriched with Vita Rich and vitamin B9. I'm sure you could remember in 2016, she won the junior category as first position. She's about repeating what she did some two years ago back at the senior level park. It will be very great because I was very happy when she made it to the final. Having won the junior category, um, what we've just tried to do is to build up on that. Of course, she's come into senior school and she's had to juggle in uh, sciences with everything, but I think she has done a pretty good job of still being able to remain on the top. Juliette is the kind of person that always tries to get number one. Even when we're kids, if we do a competition and she doesn't carry first, she would just get all emotional and be like, oh, why, why, what did I do wrong, what did I do wrong? Julia Tekoko is a very wonderful mathematician. She's somebody that motivates herself. She finds something to push her out. In all, she's a serious and loving child. My mom has been very supportive. And my friends. I discovered her love for mathematics right from a nursery through primary school. It has been a treat from all our children to have mathematics as one of their good subjects. We've always encouraged her to take her studies serious, not only mathematics. She's very cooperative. She can endure hardship in order to be able to win. I told her to believe in God take her time, increase her speed, and just do her best and be herself at all times. When I was announced the finalist, what came to my mind was at last I made it to the final. With 95 points, Juliet Ekoko, well done. When she made it to the final, I was very elected. I was happy because she didn't really expect to make it to the finals. If I eventually win the competition, I'll be very happy because I'll be creating a record and I'll be very thankful to God too. I believe she has what it takes to win it because I pity the people she's going up against because <laughs> she's going to, <laughs> she might end up lashing them or even setting a record this time around. We are expecting that and we believe it will happen and that day I'll be intoxicated with joy because it is him that has made it possible. We've relied on him up to, up to now and uh, he has never failed us. Winning the competition again will mean a lot to me. Victor Ngwemena is the boy of the people. Permit me to say he's the man of the people. So he pulled crowd, he's a leader, he's a born leader. He knows what he wants and he tries as much as possible to get it. He's very passionate about learning and mathematics has always been his core interest and he's excelling very well at it. From the onset, he had always exhibited this uh, sense of uh, achieving, wanting to achieve. Everybody wants to be his friend because he's intelligent, he's jovial, he's quite sociable. Everybody in my family, Loves mathematics. At first, he never liked mathematics. 
I kept reminding maths at, at how easily we all solve maths and, and that maths isn't something that you just take serious and as if it's one difficult stuff like that. So we just kept advising him and motivating him and before I know it, he picked up after all, maths is like the family language. Eventually, he developed interest in mathematics because of his two elder brothers who wrote Calbell uh, State uh, exams. He actually came to me, I think I can beat IK. I said, you beat him. He said, yes, I can do better than him. I said, okay, fine, we'll support you. When I wrote Cowbell in day 2011, I set a standard for my brothers. And so far, my immediate younger brother surpassed that standard. And then Victor came and has overtaken us. He has made us proud, very proud. I think what makes Victor special in his own way is his motivation and determination to exceed above average. He always wants to be among the very best. He doesn't want to just be like a normal kid. He wants to excel. He always wants to push himself further. Chinedu, based on your last performance, I think it's safe to say you are well on your way to the finals. Congratulations. Hi, very elated, very excited. And everybody was celebrating. In fact, some of my friends gave him a lot of things without even him coming home. My mom, my brother, my family overall, and my teacher have been supportive during the cowbell and also they will be supportive in the final. Grooming him, we train him to be more accurate. You know, accuracy is one of the very important skills of a good mathematician. So we train, work on his accuracy and his speed. So that's how we've been giving him for our video. I'm not under any pressure to win and I'm just going to take it as a competition and be the best I can be. As Victor is in the finals, it has set a great standard for me and I want to achieve more than he has achieved. Cowbell, they are giving these kids a great passion for mathematics. They are making them very interested in mathematics. Most people down, that don't like maths, they'll be like, wow, because of this, they want to put in more effort and get to the top in mathematics. I will be very, very happy if I win the competition at the ending. I want you to, to have faith in yourself and also rely on God and to take the questions slow. Let's not be in a rush to finish. He needs to have patience, confidence. He knows it. It's, it's a no-brainer, it's not record science. I'm confident in him. 10 points difference between our contestants. Well done to three of you. You did very well. You did very, very well. Jessica Austin, you are the first to qualify for round two. You're also the first to qualify for the finals. Congratulations. <laughs> Wow, we should be led to celebrate. We are so excited. We are praying when we receive the message that she made it to the final. Though she wants to trip me a bit. <laughs> well, I felt very okay because I knew she was going to do something like that. Uh, she has been doing like that even right from the first time I met her. I was very, very happy for Jessica to reach to that final stage. Right from her childhood, she showed intelligence in most things she did. So from there, I know she will be a special child. And that is also the meaning of Jessica. Gracious gift from God. What do you do outside mathematics that people don't know about? Love dancing. You love dancing? What type of dancing? Street hip dancing, hip hop? Was there a day you said, you know, I'm not practicing. I'm just going to listen to music. I'm just going to eat and sleep. Why is that? Is the pressure too much? Okay, I wish you all the best. Welcome back, Jessica. In fact, she never rests on mass. Even in school, they call her uh, Miss Mass. <laughs> I'm not all that too good in math, but other science subjects, uh, I do teach her, then she teach me math too. So we do encourage each other. I would advise her to uh, put more effort so that she will make it at the, st uh, at the final stage. But I would want her to work on her speed, possibly, because she has been okay but at least add a little more to what she has been doing here. Uh, she has what it takes to make it to the finals. It should be fast enough. Good to see you again, Jessica. You just felt like coming to see me again or you came to win, which one? Came to win. You came to win. We will feel so glad, so happy, and we also put Kawepedia in our prayer that God will continue to be providing for them blessing then since they are providing for the poor. I'll be very, very happy 
fact, she also did something like that when she was in GS3. And I believe that by the special grace of God that she will actually do more. And that will be very, very good for us. If she um, wins the, um, the competition, I will use the money to pay for her um, university um, um, fees. Cowbellpedia is um, second to none. I've not seen a competition like this. God, though, see these people, I don't even know them, but they are, they are, they are helping the poor and they are motivating children that are uh, uh, mathematics inclined. I wish you better luck this time around. Thank Welcome you. Welcome back. Albertpedia, 60 seconds of fame starts now. Abdul Aid Nafisat, Oje Omotoma, Lati Kikiri, Ode Like Uma Kaiwi, Nibu Buiba. Lati Le, Lati Bazi Bere School, Fujishi Wedada, Tati Fera Mathematics. Koto Dikwe, Mamma Fonti, Koptiso, Kosini Koma Babu, Lodon, Nisku, Kosi Ogman, Kagbebu Mali. I started falling in love with mathematics from my primary school. On a Simo Balat and a lower Nikwe Koma, Lossi Le, where they did. I was very happy when I realized that I qualified for the final. Fisat, congratulations to you. You scored 100 points, which means you joined Chinedu. And you two are taking the final two slots in the senior category in the final. My sister's achievements also inspired me to join the cafe competition in our school. My parents and my teachers have been very supportive. I encourage her to increase her, to increase her speed because speed is the most important thing in that competition. I encourage her to increase her speed because speed is the most important thing in that competition. My love in mathematics is by helping me solving some questions when difficult, that are difficult. If I win the competition, I will feel very happy. I believe that my sister has what it takes to win the competition. And the Kabek PDR TV Quisho has encouraged me to love mathematics. My dad has been an inspiration to me, and winning the competition will make him happy. If my sister wins this competition, I will feel very happy. <laughs> Enoch is a special gift from God and he has always been a cool headed boy right from inception. He's a kid that likes to, you know, take things as they come. He's our deputy head boy, and so he's also a leader in the school. My friends, teachers, and parents have been supportive to be all tradition. Uh, grooming students is not just a one man's effort. It's a collective effort of the mathematics teachers, and even those are not even the department, too. So. You know when you find a willing horse, so the tax is a small. He has a knack for mathematics. I fell in love with that when my primary school teacher told me I was going to be representing a mathematics competition. He loves math too much. Anything, when he's trying to gist with you or anything, there will be at least a calculation in it, or most of it will be calculation kind of thing. They do normally call him professor. He has a very good psychomotor and cognitive ability in problem solving. I think I need to work on my speed and accuracy in the 60 seconds of him. Enoch, your smile might not be as broad as Juliet's, but I'm sure you're smiling inside. You have 110 points. Well done. I was very happy for him, and I knew that, well, since he was very smart, he's going to at least try to make it. I was so excited, though. I'm very, very happy. Because of the uh, rigorous exercise, he has really gone through. And we are happy that, you know, all the hours he has put in, all the time and the sacrifices eventually paid off. So winning this competition will mean that effort that we put in, in here in our school are genuine efforts. It will also show us that uh, we are doing the right things. For we the teachers and for those that are looking up to him too. So it will be a great 
um, achievement for all of us. The advice that I will give him is that uh, he should continue reading his book. Not to get too stressed up, because since he likes math in the first place, he should just do what he loves doing the most. While at the same time, put God first, because without God, nothing can be achieved. Since the fastest and um, getting the answers right and being uh, working on the speed is what can make him win it. So our advice is should work on that. The Kalbapedia TV quiz show is a good initiative. Tell students to like Matt Stimon. If Enoch wins the competition, I will be more, 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 more happy. That is a special task given to God. Enoch has all the uh, appellations, has all the encouragement and has all the integrity and everything to move forward and Jesus will take him there in Jesus' name. Itikai, great to have you. So what have you been doing to practice? I've been using the Carpepedia app, then also I've been watching the previous episodes. I wish you all the best. Thank great you. to have you back. One thing I can even discover in her is that she doesn't joke with her academic work. Almost all of her time she spent is on reading. I started solving maths before my primary school. My dad used to train me and coach me. I've made them to understand that when you know mathematics, all other subjects will be easy for you to solve. When I qualified for the finals, I was very happy. Your spot is secured in the final. Well done. Congratulations. Thank you. I know she will get to the top. So I was really overwhelmed. I was very happy when she was qualified to the finals. I've been hoping that one of my children, as a mathematics teacher, should be represented at that level. After all, Daddy has been teaching math since all these days. And now it is time for us to, to see the dividend. When she was practicing for this cover video, the way she was answering the questions, it inspired me a lot because I've always wanted to be part of this competition, but I never had a chance. But at this time, I'm going to make sure I get a chance to be there. For me to win the competition, I have to work on my accuracy and I still need to get faster. Then I need to set it down. If you watch her on the screen, you will know that she's not under pressure because the nature, uh, nitty gritty of mathematics is already embedded in her. The only advice I have for her is to continue to practice and improve on her speed. Um, I don't see anybody on the track. We all have the same questions, apart from this difference of them. Winning the competition will give us a kind of a higher profile. Being a gifted and talented centre, uh, all other schools, uh, parents will look at our school as a model. I feel this competition is a very good one as it helps students all over Nigeria to love math the more. We have to praise Kaubepedia for this feat. They have been very wonderful and they have been supporting education. And I pray that God will continue to move them forward. If you want to be part of the Cabalpedia project, your time starts now. It will interest you to know that apart from the prize money and plaques, the winners from the junior and senior category also get an all-expense paid education excursion abroad. To take part in the 2019 Cabalpedia Secondary Schools Mathematics TV Quiz Show, registration has opened and all you have to do is register online at www.cabalpedia.ng. Manual registration has been stopped, thus registration for the competition is now strictly online. However, the rules remain the same. Ten students from a school are to be registered, five from each category and a minimum of two girls from each category for a mixed school. The Cabalpedia app is still available for you to practice and you can download it to Android and iOS. Don't forget, only your school can register individuals cannot register for the competition. To watch Cowbellpedia and see all our past and current episodes, please subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash Nigeria. 
That's youtube.com forward slash Cowbellpedia TV Nigeria. Doting parents, loving siblings, supportive friends and family, and best of all, dedicated teachers have all made significant contributions to the lives of the incredible 12 Mats gladiators who will file out at the finals next week. Only two of them will emerge as 2018 Cowbellpedia champions and next future inventors. Who they will be, even I, the quiz master, cannot tell. But what I know is this. If you keep a date with me next week, you will see the champions step forward to receive their well-deserved trophies and prizes after a fiercely fought battle on a final that you will not want to miss. Until then, stay inspired, stay connected, and enjoy the goodness of Cabell R Milk, enriched with Vita Rich and Vitamin B9 for stronger bodies and sharper minds. It's been an honor and a privilege sharing the stage with some of the brightest minds across this country. But the journey is not over just yet. We have the final, which is the climax, where we get to crown the undisputed champion in mathematics in the junior and senior category. Two million Naira cash prize is up for grabs, 1.5 for the first runner-up, 1 million for the second runner-up. The teachers are not left out of this because without them, we wouldn't have the caliber and the quality of students we have on this show. The first teacher will walk away with 500,000 Naira, followed by 400,000 Naira and 300,000 Naira respectively for the first and second runner-up. It's been fun. Thank you very much for being part of this journey. Thank you, thank you, and thank you for making sure that we have a reason to come to your set every week.